Hello ladies and gents, welcome to my Optifine tutorial. It's about time I've done this video. People have been asking for it, people have had problems with Simply Horses Texture Pack. It's all rather nuts. And I've been too busy with my LP and life in general to have... I didn't have time to make this video, so I finally have time. I'm gonna make this video and we will see how well this works. So, Optifine is essentially... That's not the right word to use. It's like MC Patcher, but it's not. I have had only one major crash issue with Optifine, and that was when I tried to install Simply Horses for the first time. Haven't ever had a crash with Optifine before or after that, and with MC Patcher I was crashing all over the place because I was probably doing something wrong, but... I love Optifine way better, so I would recommend Optifine over MC Patcher any day. So to download MC Pat or bleh, Optifine, go to Google, type in Optifine, and it should be the first one that comes up. 1.2.5 Optifine HD B2 Minecraftforum.net. So click on that one. You are probably, well, maybe going to be extremely confused with the forum page because there's a million different downloads. You have Optifine HD C1, A7, and then you have these ones down here. These say preview, so I'm assuming those are going to be the new versions. I would recommend downloading Optifine HD B2 standard, which is just basic, for 1.2.5. It has uh, support for textures, fonts, and uh, better grass, which is actually a feature of MC Patcher. Um, there's been added textures for uh, wood and stuff, so it's up to date. And they have fixed the transparent chunks bug that was seen in 2.4. You can also have the option of downloading. The different option here is uh, B2 Smooth. If your graphics card can handle it and you want smooth textures, that's fine too. And then uh, there's Multicore. Not really sure what Multicore does. I'm assuming it's probably for servers? Maybe? And then there's A7 and this one. But these two. Oh, well, that one is updated. This one is not, so do not download that one. For basic everyday Minecraft, Minecrafting, unless your graphics card can handle it, I would suggest the standard, because I know it lags the crap out of my laptop to have Optifine Smooth. So, you download the standard. You go to Add Fly, Skip Add, Download, etc. I already have it downloaded, so I'm going to skip that, and go straight to where I have it saved. Alright, so I'm going to go into where I have all my mods, go into Optifine, and mine is probably outdated because mine says HD A2, where the new one is B2, so I'm assuming that's a new version, so, but it installs the same way. So you click, I extracted it to a folder, and you have all your class files. Then you open up your Minecraft, open up your bin. Open up your Minecraft jar file, whoops, and take all these beautiful files, all these class files, select all of them, drag them into your jar file, drop them in there, a little box will come up and saying if you really want to copy them, and you click OK, and then that's pretty much it. If you guys have a crash issue, please do not comment on my video about it. I have no clue how to troubleshoot with Optifine, so it's best if you have a problem to check out the forum page. I already have it there, so I'm not going to copy the files, or else that's just going to cause a problem. So, you can go into your Minecraft. Open Sesame. Come on. You go into Minecraft, you log in. And it will take you 
to Minecraft. And I'm just going to, whoa, that's really loud. I'm just going to go into my other world I always use for my projects. And I already have a texture pack on right now, so you can kind of see that. If it won't uh, lag on me here. Come on. Okay. So I have a texture pack on right now. So you go to your options and video settings, and you notice one down here that says texture packs. You click on that, and all the texture packs you have open or have in your Minecraft will pop up. So you can easily switch back to any of the texture packs that you want uh, without having to close your game and go to the main menu. Now I will show you guys by going over here. In my texture pack fix video for Simply Horses, there was a different option that you guys could use to keep the colors of your horses. And I had followed that on my own. And so no matter what texture pack I have, these horses are always going to be the uh, textures of the Simply Horses texture pack. For more information on how to do that, once you have Optifine installed, you can see my other video, because Optifine is still required, even though you altered the files. So, go back to my video options here. So, you have the option now, there's quite a few other things, so you can go to details, and there's quite a few things you can change, if you want the stars off or the stars on. And then it'll also, if you hover over them, it'll tell you which is faster. If you want your game to load fast, snow caps. Oh, show capes. Bleh. Um, and then if you want your grass to be a certain color, cloud height, fog depth. I always have most of this turned off. Just to make my game run faster when I'm doing videos, but it's not that big of a deal. And then you can have some of this. So I have particles on, but they're set on minimal. So I'm just going to put them on all, and then you'll be able to see them. And then you go to quality, and this is my favorite right here clear water. And I will go to some water here, switch it to daytime, and go to some water, and I will show you guys, come on, the difference between the two. So when you have water, and it's clear, it just means that when you go swimming, everything is so much clearer. So now i got the particles on again that weren't there before. So that's the clear water. Now if I go and put it on the default setting, which is not normally added with Minecraft. So that is what normal Minecraft looks like. You got this dark, pretty, uh, normal looking underwaterness. And then if you change that back, it just looks... I, I just think it looks nicer. It's brighter, it looks nicer. Uh, better grass. You guys can fiddle around with all this and see what you like the most. And then there's some new performance uh, things as well as some other. So you guys can mess around with the settings on your own. That's how you install Optifine. If you already have it installed, you shouldn't. I repeat, shouldn't. Doesn't mean you won't. Have issues with with uh, installing different texture packs. If you do, I apologize, but I won't know how to fix it. So, that is it for this video. I hope that helped a little bit. I'm not overly knowledgeable on this particular mod. I just use it for my texture packs and for the clear water. So, for more information, you guys will have to go to the forum page, as well as if you happen to need some help troubleshooting a game crash.